Well, it's Wahahahine <laughs> Wednesday. Wow, that was beautiful. Thank you. Today, Marcy's getting a look at what it takes to work with your sisters. Wow, I'm working with my sister, and he can mm -hmm. sing. Uh, three sisters opened Stop at Vineyard in Orange, and Marcy has been getting the full tour, and it looks like you have some tasting set up there for you. We sure do. Hi, Scott. You totally redeemed yourself by not remembering what was in the containers behind me. That rendition of the Wine Wednesday song was delish. I loved it. Thanks, Marcy. All right, I am here with Alexa. <laughs> of course. We are talking about all the fabulous wines that you have here at Stapa. You told me, I asked if Stapa was somebody's last name, and you were like, oh, silly gal. Tell us what Stapa means. Uh, Stapa is an Italian word, and it means to uncork, which is why our logo is the old so cute, <laughs> so appropriate. All right, so we've got beautiful flights in front of us. Take us through what we have here and let's try some. Okay, yeah. So these are actually all my favorite wines that we have to offer okay. here. So very special treat for you. Yeah. Um, Cayuga White is going to be the first one we'll try. Okay. This is our Cayuga White grape and it's mm. our Sauvignon Blanc. So this is a hybrid from Savignon. Okay, yeah. and the, the grapes are grown here. Grapes I heard here, a little yeah. bit that Cayuga grows well in this area. Can yes. you confirm? Yes. So okay. that's our five hybrid grapes. They are just very susceptible to the weather. They can sustain um, the rain, the humidity, a lot of it. it. So it grows very nice here. Yes. Fabulous. Okay, yes. let's do a little cheers. Let's try it. Oh, I like that. It's very so smooth. It's it, so yeah. crisp. It's so crisp. I love that. Delicious. What would you pair that with? Oh gosh, you could actually pair that mm -hmm. with uh, fit, any kind of fish you yeah. could do. I like to pair it with my mouth just yeah. because oh it, God, you don't need anything thing. else. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. This one is my favorite because it just goes down so nicely. <laughs> yeah. It's a sneaky one though because I feel one. like, you know, five glasses later you're like, wait, yeah. I thought I had for one, sure, Alexa. Sure, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. We're moving on to a rosé now. Our rosé, yeah. So we make this one with our Marquette grape. Okay. So it's a red wine that we make a white out of. Mm -hmm. A red grape we make our white out of. Fantastic. Fantastic. Um, and what am I going to pick up in this? Well, rosés are classic for strawberry. You'll yeah. get some citrus in there, too. It's I love the color. Nice, once again, refreshing. And you get a deeper color because it is a red wine grape. Okay, awesome. All right, let's try it. Delicious. Oh, oh, it changes from the, when it first hits your mouth till right after. It does. Wait till the next one. Oh, <laughs> such a fun adventure. I love it. That is delicious. I could totally see having that with Those almost like a, like a stronger cheese, too. I yes. feel like that would kind of mix and mingle. Yes. Okay. What do um, we have now? Our next one is 06477, which is our dry orange Sounds wine. like a Star Wars character. Yes, What's that it about? Is our zip code. Oh. And we're just... <laughs> I've lived in Connecticut all my life, folks. Wow. <laughs> That's so but this is our dry orange wine, okay. and this is one of my favorites. It's just so unique and so different. Why is orange wine like having a moment? Do we know? Did somebody just rediscover it? You, you know, know like you guys. I, I you saw it in a, in a TV show, okay. Dead to Me, and I just was so yes. interested. And I said, why Huge are these... That show. What are these essentially wealthy women drinking right. because we have that client. What are we so. drinking? <laughs> yeah. <I'm not> really <laughs> and so I started researching it and we made, this is our second one and it's just fantastic. Okay. Oh, I can't. Another little cheers. Ooh. Ooh. This one is pungent, girl. It's very floral. It is very it's floral. Very floral. Yeah. It has, you know, you keep all your, your crisp white flavors, but it has that red body to it. Which, floral is the best way to describe it. Yes. You're getting those notes of flower. That's so insane. You still insane. get that bit of lemon like elder zest flower in there, almost. An orange zest, I mean. Yeah. Oh, yes. delicious. So it's very fun. All right. And we're capping it off with a lovely red, I see. Yeah. What is So that? our Sorelle, this is our Three Sisters blend. Okay. Um, so Sorelle is Italian for sisters. We are owned by three sisters, myself yeah. and my too older. Um, so this is the wine that I made for them to celebrate, celebrate your sisterhood. Yeah. That's yep. fantastic. We'll do a little cheers. So you're the baby of the group? I am the baby. Oh, I know. God. I know. Spoiled, but you know. <laughs> Delish. 
Yep. Oh, I love the way that so finishes. This is too. our high end. It is um, this one here has Chilean Cabernet Sauvignon. Only the in best it. for Only the sisters. The yes, yes. You're like it's high end so like it's us. Cabernet Franc and then Chilean Cab Sav. It's the only wine that's not 100% ours. Okay. So you still get a taste of orange in every single glass of ours and yes. bottle. Um, but this one we get our 14. I love that. I get in almost like a black cherry a little bit in there. Yes, is that right? Some chocolate, okay. some toastiness in there. Yes. Uh, we get that from our um, barrel aging. So, so delicious. Nice. Now I see you have a whole list of events coming we do, up. Yeah. What is happening here? So we have some live music. We'll do at least two times um, a month. We have a sip and paint. We're doing a painting a charcuterie board. Okay. It's actually almost sold out now. Wow. Uh, like I said, we have our rosé garden that's going to be. I'm sorry. I'm so. Time. I'm listening to you, but I'm so distracted. Who are those cute men that are walking in? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> ah! uh, our first one coming. Who in goes there? State your names. Is Marcelo Meadows? Yes, there we are. One of our winemakers. Okay. Us. And then Sterling Charles, who is my husband. Okay, so I won't hit on that one. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> Who came in time to, you know, give me coffee Actually, after you guys, our I just did a flight and it was delicious. Way to go. Yes, I'm really proud of you. All right, guys, we're going to see you right back after this break. <laughs>